Hi, pals. Coming up on this week's episode of Go With The Heat, it's the stunning conclusion of the Sonny Burnett arc as he's finally able to cure his amnesia in the episode Redemption in Blood. On this week in Vice, we're taking a look back on when this episode of Miami Vice aired from November 6th to November 12th, 1988, when Miami Vice was king. In news, on November 8th, Vice President George H.W. Bush was elected President of the United States, defeating Democrat Michael Dukakis. In the landslide victory, President Bush was the first sitting president to be elected president since 1836. Read my lips. In music, the Beach Boys' rise to the top would be short-lived as their one week at the top of the Hot 100 comes to an end. Replacing the aging rockers is the Escape Club with Wild Wild West. From the album of the same name, I'd actually Tell like to go back to the In movies, whoo, boy am I excited to talk about this one. The box office has stagnated in 1988 through October and into November, but John Carpenter is here to save us. Starring the one and only Roddy Piper and the amazing Keith David is the sci-fi horror classic They Live. The art, the tone, and one of the best fight scenes ever, this cult film was one of my all-time favorites from the decade and this genre. We miss you, Roddy. I have come here to chew bubblegum and kick ass. And that's everything you need to know that was happening when Miami Vice was king. Be sure to join us on Go With The Heat at GoWithTheHeat.com. I'd love to hear from you. Email the show GoWithTheHeat at gmail.com or follow us on Twitter at GoWithTheHeat. That's all for this week. Bye, pals.